So I have decided to test some of this, <clears throat> um, this, uh, what would you call it? State citizenship kind of things. Officially, there's only a couple things I can do to test it without putting myself in trouble. One of them is trying to get a Z plate. Now, Anna Van Wrights says that you can just go to the DMV and get yourself a Z plate. It's under the regulation Z, which I can't find anywhere on the internet. I can't find any regulation Z for the DMV. There is a regulation Z that has to do with fair hiring practices, I think, but it has nothing to do with uh, driving or uh, traveling privately with a private plate. Uh, <clears throat> so this is this is my opportunity to see how much BS there is with this, and how if I if if they hand me an order for a Regulation Z license plate and tag, if they hand that to me, I I will fall out of my chair. I think it's crap. I don't think I don't think you can travel with a private plate issued from the DMV, and it's called the Z plate. I, I don't think so, but we'll find out. <clears throat> Hello, I had a question. I heard that there is such a thing as a Z plate. It's like a private plate. You ever heard of that? A Z plate? Yeah, I don't know. It's supposed to be under regulation Z. We'll supposed to be able to come to the DMV, order a Z plate, and it's uh, supposed to be a private, private plate. Never, Never heard anything of... about like that. I didn't think you probably have. Yeah. I don't know. Why. I thought I'd check it out. Though. Why we'd have a private plate for the public? Well, that's what I heard, so I figured I'd just check it out. Yeah. You can't type it in the computer, maybe something will pop up in the, in the darkness yeah. of the, uh, some hidden secret spot. You know what? I've read all the emails that have come out lately, and I have not read anything about a C plate. Yeah. Right. Doesn't okay. sound legit. What's the purpose of it? Um, to, the purpose of it is to, um, just to demonstrate and um, to to allow the the policemen to know that you've changed jurisdictions from driving to traveling. That's the theory of it. Yeah. Wait, she's going to do a statement. That's what it is. Okay. Well, okay. figured it was worth checking out. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Yep. Have a good day. I knew it. I knew there's no such thing as a Z plate. I'm getting so tired of misinformation. Ugh. Like, I... I know for a fact, because I've read it, I've read it in all kinds of different, like, dictionary, like, uh, black law dictionaries and Supreme Court rulings, I know there's a difference between driving and traveling, um, the driving code, the highway traffic code, all that, there's so many different ways of proving it, that you do not need a driver license to travel, to be on the public highways, it's, that's fine, so, that's true, but then you have these other people saying, oh, just order, get, get yourself a Z plate from the DMV. That'll take care of it. Are you kidding me? I just went to the DMV, asked for a Z plate, told them it was under regulation Z, and they looked at me crazy. I even had them type it into the computer, and there's nothing there. So you really have to do your homework if you're going to look into reclaiming your rights because there's a lot of misinformation out there, and it's starting to really aggravate me because I know what my rights are. I just don't know how to reclaim them. The reclaiming the rights is the tricky part, not knowing them. It's easy to find out what your rights are, but how to actually reclaim your rights, that's the tricky part. Yeah. <clears throat>